Let's go. You lead the way. Where are we headed? Towards a net zero future, of course. Cleaner water, more electricity, a sustainable society. That's the destination we've set ourselves. This, we know. Yes, we know exactly where we're going, but we need to get there quicker. So, let's build on the progress we've already made by working and walking together. With the right partners, tools and ideas, we'll become an unstoppable force. This, we know. Right now, there are businesses who are putting technology and sustainability at the heart of everything they do. Brave leaders turning maybes into realities and building something better for everyone. Now is the time to look to the future and reinvent ourselves today, empowering others to do the same tomorrow. Yes, we know what the future holds and we know how to get there. So let's take charge of the journey today. From Athens, Greece, uh, and in Greek, please. Ένα πολύ θερμό uh, καλησπέρα σα και καλώ ήρθατε, καλώ όρισμα από την Αθήνα μα, από την Ελλάδα μα. Uh, we're so humbled and grateful to have you with us today, joining our live event from I Love Dyslexia EFL School uh, in Athens, Greece. Uh, I Love Dyslexia is the first school in the world for teaching English as a foreign language to students with dyslexia and special educational needs. I Love Dyslexia is the first school in the world who is giving power to 700 million charismatic students with dyslexia to acquire a global heart, a global voice, and a global mind. I am Ageliki Papa, the founder, CEO, and head director of studies of I Love Dyslexia AFL School. And today I have with me two wonderful special 
wonderful colleagues of mine, Ms. Uh, uh, Paraskevi Karayorgu. Uh, welcome, Paraskevi. Paraskevi is the leader of uh, is a, one of the leaders of um, our workshops. She holds uh, a bachelor's degree in English and a master's degree in inclusive education. She's a brilliant student and she works very hard for 3D Lexia Paradigm. We're very grateful to have you here, uh, Paraskevi. Also, another special and wonderful colleagues of mine, uh, Veneta Markopoulou. Veni has been very, uh, a very dear in my heart, and she's uh, a very special contributor to I Love Dyslexia and 3D Lexia a Paradigm. She holds a bachelor's degree in English and a master's degree in Tissot. Veni, you are so much in my heart. Thank you for being here. And last but not least, we have the voice of I Love Dyslexia, the voice of the world and the voice of love with us, the voice of a child. Odysseus Dokoros is with us today. Odysseus is 14 years old. He's an activist and he's, a award. he's been awarded by the Princess Diana Foundation in the UK for his important humanitarian activities through SOS for Love Project. Odyssea, not only you're a student of I Love Dyslexia, not only you are the future leader of the world, but you are a very good, a dear teacher of my life. Thank you for being here and welcome. So uh, do not forget, please, to use your, uh, the, the hashtag uh, uh, World Do Week in your Facebook and uh, the social media that you're watching us. Do not forget to send us your questions in the chat in Facebook. We're here to answer you your, all of your questions. If we don't have the time, do not worry. Just email us at info at ilovedyslexia.gr and we will be there for you. Um, and please, do not forget to open your heart for the next 24, for, sorry, 40 minutes. So you can receive the message of love, the message of humanity from a school that has been built in the energy of higher love. So, Miss um, Sekarayorgu, the floor is yours. Thank you, Miss Papa. Welcome everyone. I'm so excited and humbled to begin by sharing a little bit of the unique story behind the origins of the global innovation of I Love Dyslexia EFL School. And I will continue with insights from 3D Lexia Method of English and 3D Lexia Paradigm as applied in the ILD classrooms. It was 1998 when Miss Papa met her first two gifted students with a different brain of dyslexia, Nicholas and Stereos, who suffered from exclusion and bullying in the Greek education system with detrimental consequences in their life. In the slide, you see Nicholas's imaginative drawing, which in combination with a tragic story behind it, transformed Miss Papa's life, discovering later on through her own son's dyslexia diagnosis that she herself is dyslexic too, something that explained her own challenges in school, but also her out of the box, creative and innovative thinking the gift that many inspirational people with dyslexia carry and carried that is changing the world like Albert Einstein, Thomas Edison, Pablo Picasso, Salma Hayek, President Kennedy, Richard Branson, Bill Gates, Steve Jobs, and so many incredible minds. When Miss Papa realized that there were no complete methods for teaching English as a foreign and second language to students with dyslexia and special educational needs globally, and that one to five students with dyslexia or SEN in every English class internationally remain illiterate in such a crucial life skill, she started passionately developing and practicing her innovative practices in the classrooms she was teaching, only to be fired, finding strong opposition from conservative authorities who were unwilling to replace the outdated educational methods to provide inclusion for all. It was then when Ms. Papa devoted herself to empowering millions of gifted students with dyslexia and SEN globally, wrongly stigmatized as less able and lazy to succeed in EFL and help them unlock their gifts for the benefit of all society. Deeply influenced by her inspiration, the cognitive neuroscientist, Dr. Marion Wolf, whose research revealed that the human brain was never born to read and the unconventional big picture thinking for the students with dyslexia, she received precious support from her tutors from the University of Birmingham, UK, to, to complete her action research based on her inclusive EFL method. Enlightened by the precious insights she received from the different thinking of her students, her next step was to move on, scaling up 3D Lexia for English inclusive method to a new paradigm in pedagogy for all students, both typical and non-typical, and for all lessons, 
with a big vision to help transform global pedagogy for a new earth of peace and higher love. To achieve that, she expanded her studies from the mechanical brain research to human consciousness, heart intelligence, and the philosophical interpretations of quantum mechanics in the pedagogical practice that challenge our notion of what is reality and who are we really as human beings. Despite the fact that these notions are hard to grasp and seem like rocket science to many, the Isle of Dyslexia school team is willing to get outside of its comfort zone to build education of the future now, as we identify with the words of the Apollo astronaut Edgar Mitchell that the issues humanity faces are too important to ignore either by neglect or lack of understanding, as our very survival of all life on Earth depends upon it. Ms. Papa, organizing 3D Lexia paradigm under the harmony and completion of the number three, as described by the ancient Greek philosopher and mathematician Pythagoras of Samos, connecting science, technology and art, heart, brain, mind and universe, and spreading it globally from the public education of Tucumán, Argentina, to all the UN and the OECD countries, as 3D Lexia Paradigm is officially presented and accredited by all these prestigious organizations. All this powerful journey led to the genesis of Isle of Dyslexia EFL School in 2009, initially in the playroom of a friend's house. Recognized by the British Council UK, and receiving the public trust of His Majesty King Charles in Stavros Niarchos Foundation in 2018 as the first school and complete inclusive method in the world to empower millions of marginalized students globally to succeed in English as a foreign and second language, but also typical students. Now, let me please clarify that I Love Dyslexia offers specialized English lessons as afternoon programs and our students attend lessons in ILD after they finish their mainstream or special school day obligations. In the next slides, you can enjoy the high aesthetics of the premises that ILD moved to two years after, after its establishment, empowering creativity and imagination while nurturing the heart and mind of all students, kids, teens, and adults. And let's also have a look at what is happening initially in the classroom, offering one-to-one -one lessons. As our differently able students face social emotional challenges due to marginalization in the Greek system, 3D Lexia transformative lessons start by taking the time to develop hard connections between teachers and students based on mutual respect, compassion, genuine care, open communication and unconditional love, celebrating each other for who they are and the power that neurodiversity brings to the world. Before the EFL lessons begin, students receive self-awareness sessions, sharing in a fun way how the brain, mind, and heart intelligence works, how to learn differently, how everything is connected with the universe on an energetic level, and how this affects our life. Moving to the EFL skills pre presented in the slides, students do not learn rules by studying EFL books, but through active play, Following the well-structured 3D Lexia method imagery tools, storytelling on smart graphemes combined with phoneme to activate their memory and a vast variety of hands-on multi-sensory activities and tech tools to boost all language skills. A magic key of 3D Lexia method is the innovative interactive 3D Lexia mind maps digital tool by Miss Papa based on cutting edge neurotechnology that helps all students with or without special needs to build grammar tenses, grammar rules, and life skills in an imaginative way while activating whole brain learning and transform with transformative results. It is a joy beyond words to watch ILD students flourish on all levels as they develop themselves holistically while building English skills effortlessly, leading to a 100% success in all EFL official exam certifications opening new horizons in their life as useful global citizens, proving that all is possible when you commit yourself to discovering the different gifts everyone carries and when you offer them to humanity. Now, before I give the floor to the next speaker, as an educator in I Love Dyslexia, allow me to express one of the greatest hopeful lessons we all receive that changes the way we see life. 
being an afternoon language school of only 10 teachers that had the perseverance to find itself in the top 10 schools globally, creating an impact and innovation that transforms the global pedagogy of the 21st century, makes it real life proof for all that the power of a tiny drop of pure luminous love can change the world. Thank you everyone for your attention. Ms. Papal, the floor is yours. Thank you so very much, Ms. Karayoru, for this wonderful presentation and so heartfelt words. Um, Ms. Markopoulou, Makropoulou, the floor is yours. Hello, everyone, and thank you for joining the I Love Dyslexia event. I'm excited to share key insights of how we implement the inclusive 3 dyslexia paradigm for all students, with or without special needs with you, in our experiential and transformative group workshops in I Love Dyslexia School and outside. The core goal of 3D Lexia Paradigm is to help students discover the true nature of human existence, reaching the quantum level as 3D Lexia wishes to serve uh, the students and humanity by helping liberate the soul, heart and mind through the realization of the ultimate truth of who we are and why we are here on earth. We do this by connecting a wisdom and values-based education to the EFL curriculum, exposing students to the transformative activities based on the three pillars of cutting edge science, technology, and art. In this line, we cultivate through the English language curriculum, crucial life skills from STEAM competencies to deep self-awareness, empathy, compassion, curiosity, problem solving, imagination, resilience, collaboration, and the ability to adjust and reinvent yourself, enabling students to become literate and active agents of a new bright future on earth for the benefit of all. To design predilexia activities, we bear in mind that just like everything in the universe is interconnected, it is essential for the human brain to connect new knowledge with experience and real life situations to make sense and grow out of it. In this line, we create our own unique EFL curriculum, changing not only how we expose students to the learning process in the most creative, experiential and purposeful way to inspire, motivate and transform them to their best versions, but also what the new knowledge we expose learners to will be so as to expand their self-awareness, intuition, and consciousness to reach their maximum potential as virtuous beings and the Aristotelian eudaimonia, the condition of a human flourishing in all levels. In the next slides, we are entering the ILD workshops where we use the powerful dynamics of mixing primary with secondary and high school students in many activities like drama play, as well as creating separate workshops for our adult students. Just like there is a lot of active outer work in 3D Lexia workshops, there is inner quiet work too. We practice meditation, breathing techniques, and yoga for classrooms, helping students to find their center, stay focused, and feel safe within their team. Teachers, are also invited to practice meditation techniques to open our heart in coherence with our mind to serve ourselves and the students in the best way possible. In the slide, you see a powerful 3D Lexia moment when thousands of teachers in Argentina followed Ms. Papa's guided meditation for heart-mind coherence, helping to cultivate genuine heart connection between teachers and students the foundation of 3D Lexia paradigm. And back to the I Love Dyslexia workshops, where teachers transform into Alice in Wonderland characters to help students discover the complex quantum world of the invisible nature of our existence and the cosmos through fun, imaginative group activities. We often connect with active astronaut trainers with the goal to create the first generation of students in the world with the ethos and the special skills of the Cosmo astronauts who manage to collaborate in peace, even during war crises on Earth, making the impossible possible. 
while William Astro, the cat, brings joy to ILD by being a teacher assistant who dares to read and write, inspiring students to believe that all is possible with faith and hard work. Some characteristic examples of 3D Lexia activities in the ILD workshops are the creation of gratitude marmalade jars as a student tool to practice raising their energy, personalized 3D stars carrying scientific information about our true cosmic nature, performances of drama plays turning complex scientific quantum laws connected with the notion of peace on earth into fictional fun stories so as to be easily understood, and the development of a series of episodes by the ILD students and teachers utilizing the power of technology to give life to Bob and Bobby Boo, two friends who discover dimensions outside the 3D world, allowing the ILD students to represent creatively their new understanding of the cosmos and our place in it. We are sharing all these through Ms. Papa's YouTube channel so you can visit it to have a better understanding of it all. Next, let me present The Breath of Love, a great example of 3D Lexia activity by the ILD students using science, technology, and art. And we want to invite you to experiment yourselves. In this activity, our students use the power of the breathing techniques they are taught to create unique pieces of art to be sold and raise money to buy food and help people in need. To inspire more to work in this level and cultivate students' tech skills and creativity with the assistance of the teachers, we used the ArtStep digital tool to build the 3D interactive art gallery Breath of Love for you to visit, explore, and feel 3D Lexia yourselves. Just go to www.artsteps.com and type ILD in the search bar to experience a 3D Lexia workshop activity yourselves with the power of technology. Last but not least, it is very crucial for us to connect 3D Lexia activities and our students with the real world, making them active agents of change from a very young age. In this line, we organize 3D Lexia events in a local, national, and global level with our students always at the center. Some vivid examples presented in the slides are the visits of the ILD students in Eleona's refugee camp in Athens, creating art events and managing to find sponsors to develop the first digital classroom for refugee children in Greece. Next, you see our collaboration with the mayor of Athens in Serafio building, creating the first interactive event in Greece called Mind the Heart of Dyslexia, based on the ILD students' artwork inspired by famous dyslexics to raise awareness in the most creative way about the power of neurodiversity in the world and the urgency for inclusive education. Moving on to a national level, in the next slide, you see Ms. Papa on Crete Island collaborating with the local authorities of public education. She's been volunteering for 10 years to bring 3D Lexia to the public education of Greece. We are moving on to a global level where the I Love Dyslexia students become activists from the United Nations to the European Parliament and the European Space Agency through their own SOS for Love project where they connect with students from 134 countries and transform the world with innovative actions on the UN SDGs from a very young age. It is just incredible to see our marginalized students transformed into empowered agents of change, utilizing their English global voice and identity in collaboration with students from all over the world, showcasing the power of the brain of dyslexia, 3D Lexia paradigm and pedagogy for higher love in real life for the benefit of all. As a final re remark, I would like to state that the way we, the family of I Love Dyslexia, experience I Love Dyslexia is not by understanding it as a school. For us, I Love Dyslexia represents a real life quantum experiment itself. Our students who, who observe it, immersed in the energy of unconditional love, create an impossible miracle that unfolds every day in front of our eyes. 
whispering Aristotle's words to believe in the invisible. And now it is time to listen to the ones who make the magic happen in I Love Dyslexia, our precious students. Odyssea, thank you for joining us. Thank you for your attention. Miss Papa, the floor is yours. Thank you so very much for this wonderful presentation. Again, and thank you very much for your immense contribution to 3D Lexia Paradigm and I love the Dyslexia, Ms. Makropoulou. Uh, but let, it's time now to give the floor to the ones who make the magic in I love Dyslexia. Of course, our gifted students and teachers. I love uh, Odyssea, the floor is all yours. Thank you, Ms. Papa. Hello, my friends from all over the world. Thank you for joining I love Dyslexia event and for your care so no students left behind. I am very grateful and humbled to have been given the opportunity to speak on behalf of my classmates, but also millions of marginalized students with a gifted brain of dyslexia globally, who unfortunately are excluded from developing crucial life skills in school, like the skill of English as a global language. English as a foreign language is a huge challenge for uh, students with dyslexia due to our different way of learning, which is not uh, accommodated in most mainstream classes. Although it has been proved that the best way to teach a child with dyslexia is the best way to teach all students. I am deeply sad to see so many students in Greece deprived from the freedom they enjoy. I am lucky to experience being an English literate person. The joy of being a useful global citizen, acting for a better world and a future student, uh, I'm sorry, a future student, the computer just now. The computer just blew off. Can you uh, I'm so sorry. Have just closed. I'm don't worry, to... don't worry, Odyssea. We will fix Open this. Again. Okay, thank you. Just need to find where I was. I'm so sorry. No problem. You're amazing. You're doing fantastic. Okay. <laughs> the joy of uh, the joy of being a useful global citizen to experience being an English literate person. As I was saying. Uh, in a lot of dyslexia, not only I managed to learn English without even studying, as all knowledge is given to students in the most natural and fun way, but to understand my, and love myself for who I am and make special friends so as to use our global voice, mind and heart together with students from all over the world and act to the SOS for Love project. In 2017, my classmates initiated the SOS for Love project in collaboration with 3 Dyslexia Cosmos in the United Nations with the support of Minister of Education of Cyprus, Costas Cadiz, and later on the Minister of Education of Tucumán, Argentina, Juan Pablo Lismajic. NASA astronauts and nurse scientists who gave us a chance to prove our unique abilities and fight for inclusion in Greece and the world, acting collaboratively with students from 134 countries on all goals of sustainable development for a better Earth. The initials SS for Love project mean students organize solutions for love and peace, but also stress the urgency for pedagogy for higher love on earth, to build a future of peace and sustainability in a time that humanity needs it the most. Due to the powerful teamwork in ILD and the valuable support from so many amazing people from abroad, from marginalized students in the, in the Greek system, we became national winners of the, uh, national winners of the Charlemagne Youth Prize by the European Parliament for the SOS for Love project. This gave me the opportunity to travel to the European Space Agency with my teacher in the Astronaut Training Center in Cologne, Germany, to initiate Mission Agape, which means higher love by the ancient Greek philosophers, through the SOS for Love project this month with a very big moonshot goal, to be trained by the astronauts trainers so as to create the first generation of students on Earth with the ethos and special skills of the Cosmo astronauts who always find the way to collaborate in peace and move human race forward, overcoming all challenges. Please visit www.ssforloveproject.com and sign up for Mission Agape. Act with us for goals 4 and 16 and get for free the innovative digital toolkit for your students. Act like Cosmo astronauts on Earth. I cannot find the words to describe my feelings when I saw teachers from Botswana, one of the most sparsely uh, populated country in the world to sign up for Mission Agape, sharing our tool, uh, our toolkit, act like a Cosmo astronaut, making new friends that I could never be able to get to know and learn from their life without a social love project is the greatest gift I could receive from my love dyslexia school. 
to share this magic experience with, uh, with me. Download the free application, uh, SOS for Love, Go to Space for SDGs, and let your students discover and act the, uh, the UN SDGs. Play and send their messages through the augmented reality astronauts of the app uh, all over the globe. Finally, do not forget to subscribe to the SOS for Love project YouTube channel to be inspired by the collaborative actions of students and teachers from all over the globe, acting in pedagogy for love and space for SDGs. There we have the chance to share with you some of the most powerful moments we have shared with our global friends that, have, that transformed our life, like when our teacher, Miss Papa, visited bomb shelter schools in the road war zone, one kilometer from Gaza, to, collect, uh, to connect students from Palestine and Israel for peace actions having only 12 seconds to find and protect herself in a bomb shelter in case of bombarding, or even having the opportunity to connect with heroic students with dyslexia in the war zone in Ukraine to initiate Mission Agape together for a peaceful Europe and world. Before I say goodbye to you, allow me to share my thoughts and feelings, experiencing my own overview effect, seeing our precious home Earth from the International Space Station during my VR training like a real astronaut in Nisa yeah. It was the moment I felt in my heart that I am not an Athenian or a Greek. I am a citizen of the world and a citizen that, uh, of cosmos, connected with all. And I felt so strongly that Pera Sfera Ad Astra and that the real meaning of life is to liberate our soul to truth, to reach freedom, acting together for peace and agape for the love of humanity. I'm deeply grateful for your attention. Thank you very much. Congratulations, Odyssea, for this wonderful effort that you made today and all your wonderful efforts you make for humanity. You can lead the world, you inspire the world, you are the teacher of humanity, you are a luminous soul that leads the way. Thank you so very much for joining us today and for giving us the power to believe that everything is possible through your voice, through your heart and through your mind. You lead the future of humanity, and we are here to serve you with all our heart and mind. So I think it's time to present the two videos of File of Dyslexia. How does it feel? when a wonderland reveals in your heart. We are all given life and the gift of being special, all unique, all equal. <laughs> A rare existence in time and space. Never to be repeated. Never to be the same. And yet, for some wise purpose, the chests remain locked. With their keys buried beneath the sand of silent rules. different to me, and the maps aren't burnt in flames, they just wait to be discovered, and some words maybe can't be written. You 
are no different to me. Mga rapaz na namirazis 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 to pitsin. You are no different to me. You are a chest full of wonders. And the key is always in your hand. And you can see that nature creates nothing without a reason. And the reason? is love. And now the second video. Uh, all of, uh, We are addressing all the educators globally right now. Please sign up to Mission I'm Happy to get your toolkit, act like an astronaut on Earth, cause more astronauts on Earth, create with us the first generation of students who are transforming the world through the SOS for Love project. Join your heart with us. I think we have a few more minutes to, um, first of all, stop crying. <laughs> Excuse me for this. It's, it's incredible to see what, a, you know, a small team, a small family of 10 teachers can do in the world, what the power of dyslexia and the power of love can do in the world. Um, please join this incredible mission and miracle with us. A mission that would never be able to be happening without the support of so many wonderful people behind it. Please let me address my deepest gratitude to all the dream family of I Love Dyslexia FL School that creates this It's Miracle and all the magic teachers and students from all over the world who connect with us empowering pedagogy for love. To my great mentor and friend, the Minister of Education of Tucumán, Argentina, Juan Pablo Lichmacher, for his trust and continuous collaboration and empowerment of our common mission for pedagogy for love, for a new earth of peace. And Agapi, the Minister of Education and Environment of uh, Cyprus, Costas Cadiz, for his valuable contribution to I Love Dyslexia and SOS for Love project. The Minister of Education of Indonesia, Turkey, Moscow, and Kazan, Russia, as well as Folk Universitat in Sweden, 
Kazan Innovative University Russia and Harvard University USA for all their valuable contribution with I Love Dyslexia EFL School. My tutors in Birmingham University and Dr. Marianne Wolf and Henry Stapp for the inspiration and knowledge they offer me. The mayor of Athens, Kostas Bakoyanis, and the European MP Alexis Yorgoulis for endorsing our fight for inclusion for students with dyslexia in Greece and globally. The British Council UK and His Majesty King Charles for giving the precious recognition, awards, and trust to I Love Dyslexia EFL School mission. His Royal Highness Sheikh Abdullah bin Zayed Al Nayan, Crown Prince of Abu Dhabi and Minister of Foreign Affairs of UAE for giving me his trust in Goodwa. The United Nations, Geneva Peace Week, the European Parliament, the European Space Agency scientists, the NASA and Roscosmos cosmonauts and the OECD for giving their platforms awards and endorsements to I Love Dyslexia EFL School and the SOS for Love Project by 3D Lexia Cosmos. I would like to address the deepest gratitude to Biopolitics International uh, Organization and my greatest mentor, Agni Vlavianou, who is not with us, but she opened the door of the United Nations for us. And um, last but not least, I would like to express my gratitude to two, two to the family of T for Education, who gave us a place, gave a place to I Love Dyslexia to dream big, but above all, my precious students with a charismatic brain of dyslexia, that through our heart connection and their gifted thinking, helped me see the horizon of 3 dyslexia method and paradigm for the love of humanity. Thank you so very much. I think we have three more minutes. I would like to recapitulate uh, a little bit of our five points. And if we don't have time to answer your questions, do not hesitate to email all to info at I love this lecture tell you are, and we promise we answer all of your questions. So key number one, invest time to connect with the heart of your students. Building a heart-based genuine relationship with them is the absolutely necessary foundation that will harmonize their brain mind, heart, soul, and body with yours so as they, they, you can thrive in lessons and life. Invest time to offer your students self-awareness sessions by offering them insights of how the brain, mind, heart work in coherence with the cosmic uh, power and energy as these are the ultimate tools nature has given us to succeed in all beyond any method and any innovative educational practice. If you need a point to start this journey, please go to my YouTube channel to see the video of 3D Lexia Paradigm and make the first step towards this direction. Take in an inclusive way, to teach in an inclusive way by use, please, multi-sensory and experiential uh, ways to present new information through its big synthetic picture, use the images, all senses and hands-on activities to simulate the whole brain so as to provide and empower uh, to uh, everything that everyone needs and the dual diversity in your classroom. If you want to teach in a transformative way though, you need to inspire and awaken the heart by stimulating emotions, imagination and curiosity to the students to reach ultimate level of enlightenment and engagement and joy in learning and life. Last but not least, give your students the opportunity to discover the power of the cosmic self by connecting curriculum with higher papers and real life projects, projects like SOS for Love Project. And please remember Socrates' words, the best human is all human beings together. Connect with heart, um, people, with the people of your heart and like-minded people and make it happen. All together, we can change the world through the power of pedagogy for love. Thank you so very much for connecting with us today. Let love prevail. Thank you. Bye from Athens, Greece.